The U.S. Army has achieved a significant milestone in air and missile defense technology with the successful completion of a missile flight test at White Sands Missile Range. This demonstration marks a pivotal step forward in the Army's efforts to enhance its next-generation defense systems and maintain battlefield superiority. The test was led by the Lower Tier Air and Missile Defense Sensor LTMDS, product office, operating under the Program Executive Office for Missiles and Space, and highlighted the Army's commitment to integrating cutting-edge technology into its defense architecture. The exercise focused on the capabilities of LTMDS, a sophisticated radar system designed to detect, track, and classify advanced aerial threats. During the trial, LTEM successfully identified a simulated air-breathing threat and relayed critical data to the Integrated Battle Command System, IBCS. The system processed the information in real-time, formulated an engagement strategy, and directed a Patriot Advanced Capability, 3-Missile Segment Enhanced, PAC, 3-MSE, interceptor to neutralize the target. This process demonstrated the seamless interaction between sensor, command, and interceptor systems, underscoring the Army's focus on creating a fully integrated air and missile defense network. The test introduced several firsts for the LTMDS program. Notably, it was the first engagement to integrate the large tactical power system with LTMDS, providing enhanced operational capacity during live scenarios. Additionally, it marked the inaugural use of the LTAMDS Secondary Sector Array to successfully intercept an air-breathing threat. The trial also represented the first mission executed using IBCS low-rate initial production hardware, a critical step toward the system's full operational deployment. Army officials emphasized that these accomplishments reflect LTAM's growing capabilities in providing comprehensive, 360-degree coverage of the battlefield. These milestones highlight the progress we are making toward delivering a robust, all-around defense against a wide spectrum of aerial threats, an Army spokesperson said. The successful integration of LTMDS with IBCS demonstrates the Army's ability to synchronize sensors, command systems, and interceptors into a cohesive network capable of responding quickly to evolving threats. LTC Farmer, LTMDS Product Manager, explained the significance of the flight test. This exercise showcases the next evolution of LTMDS capability. It provides the Army with a state-of-the-art 360-degree sensor integrated into the broader IBCS framework. Our focus remains on testing and developing these systems at the speed of relevancy, ensuring that warfighters have the operational advantage they need when facing potential adversaries. The LTMDS system was specifically designed to address emerging threats that challenge current missile defense technologies. Its enhanced radar provides extended detection ranges, improved classification of incoming targets, and all-sector coverage, which is vital for modern combat scenarios where threats can appear from any direction. By integrating with IBCS, LTAMS contributes to a layered air and missile defense strategy, enabling more efficient threat prioritization and coordinated responses across multiple defense platforms. The strategic implications of this successful test are considerable. In contemporary conflicts, air and missile threats are becoming increasingly complex, including advanced cruise missiles, unmanned aerial systems, and hypersonic glide vehicles. Traditional defense systems often struggle to respond to such multidimensional threats in real time. LTAMS, with its enhanced sensor capabilities and integrated command system, offers a flexible and adaptive solution, allowing U.S. forces and allies to maintain a defensive edge in contested environments. Moreover, the LTMDS program reflects the Army's commitment to modernization in alignment with broader Department of Defense objectives. By investing in systems that combine high-performance sensors with sophisticated command and control frameworks, the Army aims to create a responsive, resilient, and scalable defense network. These capabilities are essential not only for protecting personnel and critical infrastructure but also for ensuring strategic deterrence against potential adversaries. The integration of LTAMDS with the Patriot Missile System also represents a critical component of this modernization effort. The PAC, 3 MSE interceptor, capable of engaging a range of high-speed aerial targets, benefits from the precise targeting and threat classification provided by LTMDS. During the flight test, the system demonstrated its ability to coordinate multiple elements, 
sensor, command, and interceptor, into a unified engagement process, thereby increasing both accuracy and reliability in real-world combat scenarios. Beyond technical achievements, the test underscores the Army's emphasis on operational readiness and rapid fielding of new technologies. By conducting live exercises that simulate realistic threat environments, the Army ensures that these advanced systems are not only effective in controlled conditions but also capable of performing under the dynamic pressures of modern warfare. This approach aligns with the principle of testing at the speed of relevancy, where development cycles are accelerated to address emerging threats as they evolve. Looking ahead, the successful LTMDS flight test paves the way for expanded deployment and operational integration. Future exercises will continue to refine the system's performance, evaluate its effectiveness against a broader range of threats, and incorporate feedback from field operators. As these capabilities mature, they will play a crucial role in protecting U.S. forces, allied personnel, and critical assets worldwide, forming a central pillar of the Army's air and missile defense strategy. In summary, the LTMDS flight test at White Sands Missile Range represents a major achievement for the U.S. Army, demonstrating the effectiveness of next-generation sensors, integrated command systems, and precision interceptors in countering advanced aerial threats. With its full 360-degree coverage, enhanced detection and classification capabilities, and seamless integration with IBCS and the Patriot Missile System, OTAM stands as a cornerstone of the Army's ongoing modernization efforts. As threats continue to evolve, the program ensures that the Army remains prepared, resilient, and capable of defending its forces and strategic interests in increasingly complex operational environments.